the American Academy of Pediatrics asked a group of us to examine the issue of tackling in youth football due to the increased media attention of concussions, as well as the report of a debilitating brain disease called CTE in former professional football players. So parents are concerned and the Academy felt that uh, we really should address this issue in a statement. We looked at the evidence and found that there was not enough evidence to suggest that we ban tackling in youth football. Uh, we feel the emphasis should be on proper tackling technique with the head up and to protect the head and neck. This should prevent some of the concussions as well as more uh, severe injuries. We are concerned that if we delay tackling um, and don't allow it until the kids are bigger and older, they'll generate more force and actually be more likely to get hurt when they're older. It's a theoretical risk. It hasn't been looked at but uh, we, we worry that may be the outcome if we ban tackling at the youth level. We think the rules need to be enforced. They absolutely should forbid any head-to-head -head hits or leading with the head. And of course, even at the higher levels, American football is starting to realize that they have, those are dangerous hits and those need to be eliminated. Um, lastly, we encouraged hiring of athletic trainers who have been shown to reduce injury rates at different levels. We realize uh, not all groups can hire them, but we encourage them to do so.